what is up everyone so today I'm going to be working on installing my quick release steering wheel and hub but before I do all that I'm gonna wash my car and clean the interior I'm gonna show you the steering wheel it's NRG steering wheel and quick release with hub I've never installed one of these but I'm going to attempt it today this steering wheel is temporary until I order a grip royal steering wheel because I've heard mixed reviews on this on the energy steering wheels they bend or break easily I don't know but anyways let's get to cleaning I guess I'm gonna do the steering wheel install tomorrow. Some friends came over, we're gonna grill some carne and stuff, so I'll get back to you guys soon. Back, guys. All right, so we're finally gonna install the steering wheel. So I'll show you guys, there's a nut right in there. That's the nut you're going to take off to remove the steering wheel. But I got it.
also my camera cut out as I was pulling the steering wheel out. I got the this nut off from the middle right here, which holds your steering wheel in there. And then when you take the nut off, you have to bang it in different areas and then start wiggling, pulling at the same time. I got mine off, looked a little sketchy, but that's how you're gonna have to get it off. Move that out of the way. One thing I didn't mention is that you wanna make sure that your steering wheel was centered so your wheels are straight forward, both of them, before you start taking this off because you're gonna want your quick release to be lined up perfectly. All right, so what I did is I took off the screws that go on here that hold this piece to the short hub that goes onto your steering wheel. So this is gonna be your top right here where it says NRG. And then when you take this off, you'll see a white dot right there that'll tell you that that's the top. And then when you put this on here, you put the nut on there. I'm just making sure it's on there real nice and tight so it don't come off when I'm driving. Of course, lock my steering wheel. Now that that's on there, I'm going to go ahead and put this piece back on. Where do I keep leaving my Allen key? There it is. Remember guys, this is the first time I ever install a quick release steering wheel into a car, ever. I think so far it's been pretty easy process. I'm going to go ahead and put all of these back on before I start tightening them. Make sure all your hardware is nice and tight on there.
All right, guys, now that I made sure everything, all the hardware on both the steering wheel and the hub are nice and snug and tight, now I can go ahead and clip this baby on. There we go. Now it's on. All right, so show you guys. For those of you that don't know about quick release, so quick release allows you to release your steering wheel from the actual column. You just pull right here and she's off. Now you can take your steering wheel inside or wherever you're at. Or if you have bucket seats like for racing and all that, it's a tighter fit in here so you it's easier for you to get in and out once you release your steering wheel. way easier than I thought it would be. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you soon. Okay.